to the power of God, I, I don't know, but there are people God is raising to become mighty vessels. I just saw an anointing rest on you, this role. In the name of Jesus, I don't know where you are, but I pray may that grace now, let it rest upon you and shift you to a new dimension. In the name of Jesus Christ. Welcome to Christocentric Message. On this channel, you are going to get soul-lifting messages, faith-based content, prayer drills, and videos that would help you grow spiritually. Remember to subscribe to the channel, like the video you are about to watch, and comment on it. Stay blessed. Let it rain. Let it rain. Open the floodgates of heaven. Let it rain. Let it rain. Open the floodgates of heaven. This is not just a song. Listen to what you are saying. Listen to what you are saying. Let it rain. Let it rain. Lift your hands, everybody, inside and outside. I truly hail you, Most High. I hail you, Most High. I truly hail, hail you. Hallelujah. Hear me. The power of God is present in this place mighty. And God is going to be fishing out people and families. Hear me. Some of you will stand in for your family. Every yoke of darkness. Every curse. Every the power of God is already moving every curse outside i want you to get ready because there will be a release of fire hallelujah at the count of three hear me inside and outside at the count of three with all your heart you're going to shout jesus hear me the fire of the Holy Ghost is going to be moving in this place in a dramatic way. Especially outside. There will be mighty deliverances for you, for your family members. Every oppression, it will bow tonight because upon Mount Zion, there shall be deliverance. Lift up your hands. Thank you, Father. Take over this meeting right now, Holy Spirit. Take over this meeting. Take over this meeting. Do mighty things. I give you all the glory. At the count of three, hear me. I confront gates. I confront powers. In the name that is above all names. Out of the abundance of grace. That is sufficient in this house. At the count of three. Every devil. I speak from the realm of the spirit and i confront altars by the fire of the holy ghost you will bow at the count of three one two three shout jesus that devil of darkness come out let god's people go free outside the fire of the holy ghost 
Bring them out. Bring them out. Every act of witchcraft, every act of divination, every act of sorcery. Let the fire fall. I expose every power of darkness right now, right now, right now. Outside, outside, there are angels of deliverance in a mighty way. Bring them out. Outside, outside, there is a baptism of fire. No devil, no devil of darkness will stand tonight. Satan, the Lord will put you. Satan, the Lord will put you. Satan, the Lord will put you. Oh, there is fire in this place. No devil can stand. No devil against your destiny. No enchantment. No divination against Jacob shall stand surely they shall gather but because their gathering is not of the lord this night they will scatter hallelujah lift up your hands again outside hallelujah hear me those of you outside, at the count of three, I want you to shout Jesus. God is not done with you. Please, pick them and bring them. Many of it will be a mass deliverance. Are you hearing me? Just those outside. Right now at the count of three. One, two, three. Shetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetetet
no devil will stand we are in the presence of the Lord Hear me. Hear me. Some of you are receiving liberty. You don't have to fall and come out. Are you hearing me? But they are just living. Living. See, some of you be checking. We have not prayed for the sick yet. But be checking yourself. You will find out that miracles are already happening. Because some of these sicknesses are orchestrated by devils. Now, Hear me, the Lord Jesus Christ is in this place. At the count of three, I speak to all these demons that have oppressed these people as a point of contact. I speak as an ambassador. At the count of three, you will leave them complete deliverance. No hiding. Let the word of God search even to the dividing of the soul and the spirit. There be no hiding place. At the count of three, under this apostolic fire at the count of three you will go right now one two three go 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 come out come out come out and return no more come out come out come out and return no more. Come out. Come out. There's no hiding place. Come out. There's fire upon every devil. Fire. Shake it. It's the fire of the Holy Ghost. There's no hiding place. There's no hiding Listen, as this is happening to you, I want you to know that this is happening in your family too. Are you hearing me? This is the spirit of death in this brother's family. The spirit of death. Right now, thou foul devil, I see you in the spirit. Go, go, come out now. Come out now. Out. Hallelujah. Let me pray for this lady. See, I'm seeing horns. Horns, this is what I'm seeing. That devil is a liar. Right now, I make contact with your body by the fire of the Holy Ghost. Out of her right now. You're a wicked, foul devil of darkness. Just lay your hands on her head. In the name of Jesus. Now, come out, thou devil of darkness. There's no hiding for you. In the mighty name of Jesus. This curse of darkness is gone from this lady. Hallelujah. Ulcer. If you have ulcer, lift your hands. Anybody. Ulcer. Please. You're going to be healed now. Check yourself. Hallelujah. Now we'll take some instant testimonies. Hallelujah. We'll take some instant testimonies.
because of time we usually don't do that but just to encourage a few people lift your hands inside and outside you're suffering from peptic ulcer it will go now peptic ulcer lift your hands as I rebuke that spirit some of you have wounds those wounds will close up now now not later on just leave them God is not done with them until he's done brother look at me you're a great man but let me tell you you didn't come out for yourself you came out for your family where are you from uh -uh, not where you're coming from Edo State. Edo State this is what I'm seeing the Lord is showing me a shrine with seven stones and there's cola not in the middle are you listening to me so God is setting you free you believe that let me pray for you for your family out now those altars of darkness be gone forever please don't be quick to carry them hallelujah lift your hands altars in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ that name that is above every other name ulcers be healed now ulcers be healed now ulcers inside and outside be healed now start checking yourself check yourself miracles are happening God is healing ulcer ulcer check check the moment you see a notable miracle um, maybe we'll have a few I don't know maybe at the back one or two people the ministers who verify them will take one or two testimonies the Lord is showing who is Hanatu 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 I'm hearing the name Hanatu come now don't wait there please there's no time Hanatu Hanatu God is visiting the family of Hanatu you are Hanatu your name is you look at me God is visiting your family are you hearing me a devil of darkness spell and yokes of bondage let our family go now in the name of Jesus Christ God is not just delivering the family God is anointing this young man God will do mighty things take the anointing you will become a mighty man of God mighty man of God hallelujah sister this lady come please quickly open the floodgates of heaven let it rain let it rain I'm hearing the name Grace look at me who is Grace I'm hearing the name Grace your friend your church member we need to pray for Grace because death wants to take her life are you hearing me grace that's i'm just flowing as the holy spirit is helping me but then the lord is going to visit you in three things see listen to me number one i the lord always shows me these things because i'm seeing marital issue I, no, sir. you married do you know me have i met with you the lord wants to solve that issue right now because you're looking pretty on the outside are you hearing me but i'm seeing shadow that's the only thing i'm seeing as your face in the spirit there is no form just shadow but the lord is going to set you free number two who is doing a building project me a building did you tell me this is the second thing god is going to do supernatural grace to complete the building project are you listening to me number three god is blessing you in the area of business i'm hearing business who does business you sure don't just say yes or are you very sure shoes and bags. okay you are going to see an escalation in your business three th these three things hold my hands father that yoke of bondage I break her free from it right now ah what is this thing that I'm seeing again do you know what I'm seeing I'm not seeing a woman I'm seeing a man see don't feel embarrassed who comes to oppress you in the night you have those kind of experiences this is the man I'm seeing that devil is a liar are you hearing me let her go she must be free 
by the power of the Holy Ghost. This is what is stopping this marriage. I set you free. You will experience the hand of God, the grace of God, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Petrus, your son name is Petrus. Your son name is Petrus. Petrus, your son name is Petrus. Please, let's hurry up. Your son name is Petrus. When you have that person, please let him come out. Hallelujah. Now, if you have problem with your ears, please, we have to be fast. Ears, whether one side or if you came with anybody inside and outside, you came with anybody that is partially or completely deaf, please put your hands there right now. Put your hands right there. Some of you feel like water in your ears. Just put your hands. Please, as you're receiving miracles, some of you, I'm not mentioning your case. Just walk out, Bishop Stan and Pastor Jakes are outside. Take the courage to walk out now. Go and drop your testimony. Hallelujah. We're going to take one or two of them. The ministers are at the back. Hallelujah. They are standing. Even if the miracle has started, they'll perfect it. Look at me. Come. See. Brother, come. Where were you sitting? Outside. At the back. Hold on. What happened to you? Coming here for like very well, but I've not felt anything. So I opened up my heart. And what happened? What happened? That's the question. Body vibrating. Right? See, the Lord Jesus, because even now God has not finished. One of the things God is calling you, it will be a time of preparation, but God is calling you. You're going to be a great teacher of the word. Are you hearing me? He will teach the word very prophetically. Look at my eyes. Just look at my eyes. Spirit of revelation. My God, I pray. The eye is the light of the body. Let something happen to this brother. Let there be a straight line from Genesis to Revelation. I impart upon you. Just look at my eyes. You're receiving a mighty impartation. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Please go outside. God is visiting people. I'm seeing some, someone healed. Lump in the breast. Lump in the breast is getting healed right now. Right now. The moment it is your case, celebrate God. Check it and go out. Celebrate it. There's nothing to be ashamed of. This is, this is a outside. A lady is healed. Lump in the breast. Your right breast. Outside. There's healing going on right now. A lump in the breast. Outside. A lady is being healed lump in the breast is going hallelujah now blood disease blood disease i want to pray for blood disease whether hepatitis hepatitis is killing people like chickens right now whether it is hepatitis hiv aside from genotypes we'll pray for genotypes differently hallelujah but any other blood disease please lift your hands quickly quickly please lift your hands want to rebuke that devil thank you jesus thank you jesus if you're lifting your hands lift it because the power of god will come upon you right now in the name of jesus i pray blood disease be healed be healed right now inside and outside be healed HIV virus die now in the name of Jesus sickle cell anemia sickle cell anemia sickle cell anemia die right now please can we get another mic hallelujah okay let's just take one hallelujah so sir, um, this lady had been suffering from asthma a long time and also sorry for a long time and she said she couldn't shout and in fact right now she's lost her voice hallelujah because god healed her wife standing outside the moment man of god said that people with ulcer god is touching them right now god touched and she was healed she began to shout and she's lost her voice hallelujah can you shout for us shout. praise the lord Hallelujah. Praise the 
the Lord. Please, as more miracles are happening, don't just come out here to testify, please. Now, I want to pray for a woman. You came, you have pains. It's, it's an elderly woman. Something, I don't know if it's a growth or something. Please, who is that? Please and please, let's save time. God is healing people right now. And then I'm seeing, watch this, this part. You're feeling sometimes you walk and it's almost like you want to fall. Your bone here, come out. You're a lady. You're a lady. God is showing me the lady is holding a baby. This is what I'm seeing. You are holding a baby. Whether it's your child, who is that, please? Holding a baby, oh. You are holding a baby. Where is the baby? Was she holding a baby? Because, come. Open the floodgates of heaven. Where's where's the pain? This is the baby. This is the baby. Come, madam. You will be healed right now. Look at me. You, you can see her limping. Who can see her limping? Can you see her limping? Can you see her limping? Madam, hold my hands. You believe in the power of the Holy Spirit? Lay your hands on her. Which of them? Which of them? Where's the pain? What happened? Just like that. That devil will leave you right now. Because there is a name. Lord Jesus, thank you. Amen. Come, march your legs. Go ahead. Go ahead, march. Look at, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Is there any pain? Are you feeling any pain? Just a little. Go ahead. Just march in the name of Jesus Christ. Now check it. Walk. Walk and come. Walk and come. Jump. Look at. Look at this. Give Jesus a shout of praise. Open the heavens, let it rain, let it rain. Would you open the floodgates of heaven, let it rain, let it rain. Would you open the floodgates? Everybody sing, let it rain, let it rain, open, the Lord is ministering to me, just leave her, five months, you are a lady here, you have not seen your period for five months, five months, you have not seen your period, you've shared it with a few friends, right now this night this night i know there are lady ushers they'll help you hallelujah all kinds of menstrual issues it will disappear it will disappear right now open the floodgates of heaven as soon as i pray for you take her to the restroom you will check yourself right now right now that yoke of bondage be free now by the power of the holy ghost there's the fire of the holy ghost please take her please take her so she doesn't feel embarrassed She's not the only one. There will be miracles. There are more miracles coming. Celebrate Jesus Christ. Please, can we have another mic? So that Pastor Jakes, is there another mic? Okay, it's here. Please, just go to the back. Go to the back. Yes. Hallelujah. This brother's name is Dennis. 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 And while standing here, when the man of God said, she lift up her hands, and those that had ulcers, she lift up your hands. God is healing ulcer. They actually had ulcer and it translated into asthma hallelujah and while lifting up his hands what happened praise the lord this is my first time to come here and it led to asthmatic hallelujah as the man of god says like if you have as uh, if you have ulcer and i believe he's going to he's going to be healed and as i lift up my hand i'm having chest chest pain hallelujah but now I'm not feeling anything. It's just as cool as... Breathe, as breathe as in and out. Breathe in and out. Go I ahead. Know. Breathe in and out. Breathe in and out. In and out. Any problem? No Celebrate problem. Jesus. Hallelujah. My grain headache has just been healed. My grain headache has been healed now. My grain headache. Please check yourself. My grain headache. My grain headache has been healed. Make sure you just rush down to the back. My grain headache. Thank you, Jesus Christ. My grain headache has been healed. Now, please listen. 
there's someone you wake up in the morning your heart area here your heart area pains you it's as if your heart is tearing when you wake up early in the morning this thing has been happening for a long time who is that person your heart just just this you cannot even sleep on that side because when you rest on that side you have serious problem this is not the only one i'm seeing a lady you're a young lady you're a young lady Open the floodgates. Mama, do, does she understand English? Who brought her? Mama? Okay. What? Selena is an uh, official outside interpreter. Ask her what's wrong with her. Make it out, Mama. Her hand and her legs. Her hand. Everything. This is C. The devil once is supposed to be from my head down. This is stroke. Are you seeing? This is stroke that the devil wants to bring. Tell her right now she will, she's going to be healed and she will dance. Miracles. Look at the lady who just came. Hallelujah. You need to celebrate Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. While standing here worshiping God, she said she's had menstrual pain for a long, long time. Hallelujah. The pain had been there and while Apostle ministered to her, something remarkable happened. You want to hear? Hallelujah. Please, we need a lady to touch her stomach. She said before she were pains, so we need somebody to verify. Now the pains are gone. Yes. The pains are gone. Yes. Right. Any pain? Hallelujah. Please celebrate Jesus. Celebrate Jesus. Check yourself. Don't just stand waiting. Check yourself. God is doing miracles. Even if you're outside, just Bishop and Pastor Jakes are at the back. Mama, tell her. God is going to heal her right now. Ask her, does she believe? Tell her to hold my hands. The Lord Jesus sets you free. That devil, gone. Pain, gone. Come up. Tell her to come up and march. It's gone. It's gone. Look at this. It's gone. It's gone. In the name of Jesus Christ. Open the floodgates of heaven. Let it rain. Let it rain. Would you open the floodgates of heaven? Let it How does she feel? Is this still is the pain still there? She's not feeling any pain. Mama, let's match. Can you dance? Play any song for her. Look at, look at somebody who could not stand well. What kind of song do they sing? You, you people should learn Alsa songs for our mothers. You people don't know one Alsa song. Annie, give us one Alsa song. Ala mungo de makaya, ubangi chikai kare kai sayabo. Ala mungo de makaya, ubangi chikai kare kai say. Come on, dance, celebrate Jesus. Ubangi chikai. If God 
everybody a shout of praise. Hey. Hallelujah. God is doing a miracle outside. A hole in the teeth has been closed outside. A hole in the teeth. Check yourself. A hole in the teeth. A hole in the teeth. It has been paining you. Check. You find out it has is gone right now. Right now, the Lord is showing me a hole in the teeth is closed. The hole is closed completely. Please make sure you verify before coming. Okay. I've been having this great pain on my... Okay, great pain. my heart. Each and every moment when I wake up in the morning, it's like it shifts and it aches really for a while now. While this moment, while I was standing right here, received her healing I felt it just happened immediately praise the Lord give God a praise hallelujah please if you are healed just walk right at the back the Lord is showing me another miracle one eye the left eye of somebody outside God is really visiting people outside the left eye you don't see well with it there's you see like an image intercepting your eye is gone right now please check it what was she okay Lay your hands there. Thank you, Jesus, for your healing power. Gone. Check yourself. See, the anointing does not just come. Check yourself. Please don't, don't feel embarrassed to say you have to say yes. No. If it doesn't happen, say it. We'll pray for you here. Check yourself. Check yourself very well. Do what you couldn't do. Can you any pain i'm still waiting for the lady someone the, i think the did i say left or right now breast lump breast lump is gone is gone check it don't don't wait check check and go outside pastor jakes is there they are busy verifying people's cases inside or outside hallelujah praise the lord now um this is very interesting there's a family here that has been suffering delay and God is going to solve the problem in a very dramatic way wait, 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 listen the power of God is going to carry the person from where he is, the person will run out here with such speed this is a sign that this is what God is doing hallelujah this is what the sign that God gave me, this is very interesting, the way the Holy Spirit walks sign and wonders here from outside, from outside the power of God will pick the person he will run with the spirit of Elijah. It's from outside. Lord, let it happen according to your word. I give you praise and I give you glory. You will come out under a tremendous influence of the spirit. It's a sign that this is what God is doing. Please, let's continue before the person comes out. You will come out, certainly. This is the word of the Lord. Now, I'm seeing a baby that is sick. You came with a baby that is sick. Please, who is the person? The baby cries in the night. Please hurry up quickly. Because Pastor Jakes will still come up here and Bishop Stan. Ah, whatever mountain will not has not answered to it will answer to you this night. Who is this? This is the baby that is sick. What's wrong with her? In 2000. Open the floodgates of heaven. 2003, she was sick, so we took her to the hospital and they transfused her. After them, she was. One more person again, this same experience for one more person outside. One more person outside is going to happen again. One more person by the power and the influence of the Spirit. This is a sign and a wonder. God is restoring delay in families the power of god will just pick you from the crowd and bring you here with tremendous speed let's listen they transfuse her and after what did they say is wrong with her the doctor confirmed that she has hiv with the transfusion of blood she has hiv that's what the doctor confirmed that what HIV positive. That devil is a liar. Come, my dear. Look at me. What's her name? How can a girl bear the name Favor? 
and still have HIV. You see how demonic Satan is? The Bible says a man was sitting at a beautiful gate with an ugly situation. A lady, this is like Jabez, but tonight like the prayer of Jabez, he said, oh, that thou wouldest bless me. Hallelujah. You will go and test her. You will come back with a testimony. We will change it. HIV is a spirit. And it will bow. Sweetheart, hold my hands. Hold my hands. Both of your hands. Yeah. Just leave her. She's free. The lady with the lump. Listen, how okay? How long has it been? Please help us. Mm, for like three. How long? Three years. Right now. It's gone. Yes. Hallelujah. Lift your hands. Look at me. Lift your hands. Lord, let your power come upon her. You will perfect this right now. That which you have started, let it be perfected. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Amazing. Amazing. I'm telling you. God is doing amazing things. So if your miracle has started. Bishop is praying. Jake's are praying. We are very serious. Don't go back. Don't go back. A wrist has just been healed. You feel a pain. In fact there used to be like a growth. Check it. It has disappeared. Check it right now. It has disappeared. Check it. It has disappeared. Check it. God is doing mighty miracles. Check it. It has disappeared. Hallelujah. Now, I'm seeing a woman. There are objects that move in your body. Serious objects. It moves sometimes to your legs. Sometimes to your chest. Hallelujah. Right now, as I pray, you are going to be free and you find out that you are free. You are feeling light. Please, when that happens to you, go down. The ministers are seriously praying there. Father, in the name of Jesus, this demonic thing, this demonic thing, this demonic yoke of darkness let it leave your body right now right now right now right now come my sister what's your name grace grace when i was speaking to a lady here and i said grace i was my eyes was being fixed are you married we are going to visit marriage issues now. Just get ready. We are going to deal ruthlessly with that devil. Are you hearing me? Marriage is a good thing. Say it. Again. Say it one more time. Every good and perfect gift. Where does it come from? Where does it come from? That means every bad and imperfect gift comes from where? I tell you the truth. God is going to visit marriages right now. Look at me. Men don't come to you. Anybody that comes, they just mock you. They run away. They do all of these things. Some even insult you. Can I tell you something? You are wonderfully and fearfully made. I hope you know that God does mighty marriage miracles in this place. So when we are talking about marriage, look at another. Miracles are happening like, I tell you, there is an open heaven. And this is what happens once there is praise. Please make sure the, the mic is set. Let's take this testimony. Yes, sir. Come, sister. Hallelujah. Apostle, when you gave a word for the woman, you said somebody's something was moving. In Movement her. in her body. Yes, exactly. 
she's this is the person movement she had an accident some days ago and since then she's been having funny movement movement in, in your body even standing here in the meeting she was still having that any movement right now in your body lay your hands on your on your stomach no not on your stomach not your legs thank you jesus christ Amen, sir. jesus thank you jesus thank you jesus You're free, completely free. Give Jesus a big sister. I'm going to pray. look at me. What are you doing? You are a teacher. Yes, sir. Eh? Government secondary school. I'm going to pray for you. Why don't they like you? What is all this thing I'm saying? I don't know. Eh? I don't know. Do you know me? Did we discuss this? Because I'm seeing real hatred. They hate this woman. Eh? I'm seeing Chuck. Chuck, you are a teacher. What are you teaching? The whole class. I'm a... Okay, you the primary school, they teach everything. Oh, okay. Let me pray for you. Look at me. That devil is a liar and you should settle down. Do you believe me? Jibabala kata This one is oppression. No, this one is not just. Let her go. That wicked, foul devil of darkness. Let her go now. Let her go. Come out of her right now. Let her go. Thou devil of darkness. Release her right now. With a mighty shout. Go. Go. If there is a woman here, you've suffered barrenness or a man, anything that you have not given birth, come out here quickly. Please, quickly, quickly. Bishop is still coming and Jakes, we have to hurry up. There's a few things that will happen here. Please, come out quickly. You, you must be married though, except if you are standing for somebody. Don't be emotional about it, please, please. Be looking at your neighbor. If you are from the same place, go back. Somebody has come to represent another person. We will have miracle children in this place. Look at, look how many people the devil is stopping them from enjoying. I mean, some of them are standing in for their loved ones. Look at, look at this, look at this. It looks like they are coming out to give offering. But this is, this is lack of, lack of children you see the relevance of meetings like this listen to me who is standing for herself or for himself for yourself for yourself come here please quickly those who are standing for others this way for yourself look at me are you together She's your wife. Oh, both of you are standing for yourself. Where's your husband? He traveled. I'm seeing a baby girl. Go and write it. <laughs> Hallelujah. Can I pray for you? Hold my hands. See, let me tell you. Sister, look at me. You will come back here with your baby girl and testify. You believe that? Lord, confirm your word with power right now. Thank you, Jesus. You are set free. You're on his marriage. Why didn't you wait? This, the guy just said, okay. No, 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 no. Don't see, don't laugh. It doesn't mean you should do it anyway, but don't laugh. It's coming out. Look at me. You believe that there is supernatural grace for marriage, yeah? When when are you when is the wedding? Eh? Hold my hands. According to the time of life, I speak to you under the unction of the spirit. Before the end of this month, you will be in a very godly, serious relationship with a serious lady that is virtuous and love God. Father of spirits, connect them. You are the father of spirits in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. God bless you. Wow, mighty miracles again are happening. You too, you for yourself, lay your hands on your stomach. 
come because I'm seeing something else. What did the doctor say? Whatever that means. Well, we shall know this is not from God, whatever it is. PID, PID, we'll pray, whatever it is. And see, look at me. Wherefore God had so highly exalted him and given him a name. At least the men don't understand. Some of them, but the ladies, you understand what she said, Abby? Do you understand or not? We are going to pray. Look at me. It will go and it will give birth to a lot of children. What will stop you is discipline, not lack of... Are you hearing what I'm saying? I wish your husband were here oh, because he's not only you I'm supposed to pray for. Where is he? Just pray for him. Thank you, Jesus. Just lay your hands there. Father, perfect her. The power of God is coming upon you and that devilish thing is leaving you right now. Return with testimonies. Return with testimonies in the name of Jesus Christ. Please, let's hear Pastor Jakes. Hallelujah. Praise God. Apostle, when you give the word for somebody outside that God was feeling the person's teeth. Feeling the person's teeth. How many of you remember? Two this of her teeth. Two of her teeth. Had been removed. Can you open your mouth? Don't feel embarrassed. Two of her teeth has been removed. Look at. Sorry. I, this is bad. Viewers discretion. I'm sorry. Don't feel bad. We are disciplined people. But just so that we we'll celebrate God. Check. No hole. Look at this. No hole. I can't see any hole here. There was... Your teeth was removed. Two teeth. Two teeth was removed. Who knows her? Who knows her? Is it true that the teeth was removed? Who is that? Yes. Yes. It's, it's true. You are sure of that? Dorcas. Her name is Dorcas. Look at. And the teeth has been filled. Supernaturally. Give Jesus a big, Hallelujah. big hand. Big hand. Big hand of praise. Hallelujah. Now, all of you that are standing for any... See, if you are standing for anybody, when you go back, send the person a text and say, I just stood in for you. Now, believe and receive. Are you hearing me? Send them a text. Don't let them roam around. You are here suffering to stand in for them. They are not connecting again. Hallelujah. And because you are standing here, it's impossible for you to face anything called barrenness. I hope you know that. The Bible says, and when Job prayed for his friends god turned his own captivity job 42 verse 10 and 11 let me pray for you lift your hands look at as many people lift your hands some of you the power of god will come upon you on behalf of the people there my god children the bible says are a heritage from the lord and father you have made this place an apostolic ground in this city where there are tangible proofs evidences that jesus is alive right now i pray according to the measure of grace every yoke of bondage hear me every curse every fibroid low spam count every devil of darkness that is responsible for impotency or barrenness be lifted now in the name of jesus be lifted now in the name of jesus the power of God is coming upon some of you on behalf of your family members. I release miracle children. I release miracle children. Take it. Take it. Take it. Take it. On behalf of those you are standing for, they will come back rejoicing, testifying. Every spirit of darkness responsible for unfruitfulness. If they don't have womb, we create new wombs now in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Return back rejoicing. Send them a text that they have been prayed for and let me tell you see listen hold on hold on there are some who take in but lose the child is that true lift your hands on behalf of them because some is not that they don't take in they take in one month two months they just wake up 
in the morning and they just see blood that devil is a liar are you hearing me tonight is miracle service my god i pray the bible says the hand of zerubbabel that started this work that same hand will perfect it i pray no more miscarriage in the name of jesus everyone standing here return with dramatic testimonies in the mighty name of jesus please go back rejoicing god bless you hallelujah pastor jakes bishop stand please come please come they'll just be ministering to you in a few minutes hallelujah i know that there are areas that they will minister to you while that is happening pass the prayer request please this is a time for god to visit your case please as you are passing it be praying in tongues as you're passing it be praying in tongues say lord this is it my time has come if they didn't call you your prayer point will call your case now hallelujah god bless you sir pastor jake so just minister by the grace of god and then bishop stan sir please write your prayer request quickly trusting the Lord for and Lord communicates to me for some of you especially God will touch you hmm. God's going to be touching some of you especially what you've desired from him specifically some of you God is going to be activating some anointing upon your life an unusual kind of anointing hallelujah thank you Jesus thank you Jesus thank you Jesus thank you Jesus Thank you, Jesus. I'm sensing it being poured on somebody's head. There are people, the Lord will be pouring it upon your head. Parido, fine dan gros tiki van tahi, lingo supra tika tare boste, randa kai. One of you, the anointing will be so heavy on your leg. Heavy, heavy. They will literally have to carry you out of this place. <laughs> they will literally have to carry you out of this place. Blessings, blessings, God is blessing some people. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Blessings, God is blessing you. Shika parada na bando ko sukara ba 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 ba. Please, those of you that are serving presently, like leaders in fellowship, just lift up your hands. Specifically, those ones. The Lord wants to reward you. God will touch you. He will reward you. God will reward you right now. Those of you serving, the Lord will reward you. Father, I pray in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Let the reward come upon you. Let the reward come upon you. The Lord will reward you. In the name of Jesus Christ, let the reward come upon you. Let the reward come upon you in the name of Jesus. The Lord reaches out to you to bless you. The Lord reaches out to you to bless you. The Lord will surprise you. Thank you, Jesus. Please, that person, it's a, it's your pancreas. Just lay your hands on your stomach. You've been having unusual stomach pains. Your pancreas. I think pancreas should be in stomach, right? Pancreas, pancreas, pancreas. That's why I hear pancreas. Just lay your hands on your stomach. You've been having that problem. Right now, I pray for you in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I release healing. Let healing come to your body. In the name of Jesus, let healing come to your body. Healing come to your body. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, healing comes to your body. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. 
The Lord is going to be touching some people's eyes and you begin to have visionary experiences. The Lord is going to be touching. You feel like fire in your eyes as I pray with you right now. You feel like fire in your eyes. The Lord will touch your eyes. The Lord will touch your eyes. You begin to have visionary experiences. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, let the wind of God touch your eyes. Let the wind of God touch your eyes. The wind of God, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, the wind of God touches your eyes. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. While Apostle was ministering, God told me about somebody amongst us, and I don't know, there might be more than one. Um, the devil gives you food to eat in the dream. And when you are done eating that food, you become heavy. I don't mean physically, spiritually. Let me clear this. It's possible for God to do an impactation for you. It's possible for God to do an impactation for you in the dream by giving you food, angel's bread. It's a spiritual one. But this one I'm talking about, the devil ministers it to you in the dream. And when you are done eating it, you wake up and feel less spiritual. You feel this heaviness upon your body and upon your spirit. If you are the one, I would like to pray with you. She's one of them. Father, thank you in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I rebuke that spirit. I rebuke that spirit in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. I rebuke that spirit in Jesus' name. Go! In the name of Jesus. Go! Thank you, Father. I thank you in the name of Jesus. You are free in the name of Jesus. You are delivered in the name of Jesus. You are free in Jesus' name. Thank you, Father. I declare freedom. Freedom in the name of Jesus. You are free in Jesus' name. Thank you, Jesus. He will minister to you. Who dropped this picture? What happened to the baby? It's dead. The baby was born crippled. That devil is a liar. What did they say? No socket. This baby will stand and will walk. Let me tell you, if your prayer request gets here, it will be answered. Let me pray for marriages. Lift your hands before I pray for this. Just three things and we'll be done. Marriages. Hallelujah. The Bible says your marriage shall be a blessing. Your children will surround your table. Remember, we always share the scripture here. Please make sure you really lift your hands. Please lift inside and outside. I pray right now. Especially for those that have exceeded the normal time. You, you understand what I'm saying, right? The normal time that should happen. You are a man. You can't get a decent lady that is ready to settle down with you. And now as I'm praying this prayer, hear me. God is going to visit people. But some of you, if you know that you are not walking according to the ways of the Lord, stop it this night. Praise God. You can't be sleeping around, hopping around from man to man. One army officer to another one. One banker to another one. And then say, I don't have a husband. No, no. The Bible says, come out from among them and be ye separate. We are a holy people here and holiness is a big deal. Hallelujah. 
Praise the Lord. So as you are lifting up your hands, make sure that you are making a commitment. No sex before marriage. Don't let anybody deceive you. I'm saying it straight to the point. Hallelujah. No sex before marriage. No caressing. No all this nonsense that people do. No. Don't, don't open up yourself for demons. You tie your soul with demonic things. Be sure that you are going to keep many Christian relationships are not pure. Because a lot of people think everybody is doing it. No, not everybody is doing it. Who shall ascend to the hill of the Lord? Who shall stand upon his own? So, sister, just get it straight. Don't say yes to any brother who plans to just, if he does not have enough patience to honor you and wait, whatever is pursuing him, let him carry it out of your life. Hallelujah. I need to say this before I pray for you. God is not a magician. Are you listening to me? This is not a herbal center. This is a place where miracles happen by definite kingdom principles. Hallelujah. So make sure as you are standing here to receive, you are serious with God. And you've been involved in all these things I'm talking about. Stop it this night. Stop it this night. Hallelujah. Lift your hands. Let me pray for you. Lift your hands. Father, you put this as an apostolic platform to help and to build people and to terminate the works of darkness. And Father, this night I pray for your people inside and outside and our online community. I declare every yoke of marital delay right now by the fire of the Holy Ghost by the fire of the Holy Ghost. Be free from it now. Be free from it now. Anyone here who is of a marriageable age right now, we connect you to your life partner in the name of Jesus. And I pray that anyone here who is under any yoke, because there are some of you, it's not just you, all the ladies in your house some you notice that you marry almost at age 40 no matter what you do no matter how decent you are you will never just get a faithful man some of you is married men that keep chasing you as young as you are you can't get a godly brother you are coming to church you are serving in church the brothers are looking at you as if they are looking at this speaker and then it's only a married man with children that are old enough to be your age who will be disturbing you? That yoke of bondage. This night, kapoto sheka, repato telebata, aparato koposobata. Let that yoke be broken in the name of Jesus. Let that yoke be broken. I release you into your marital destiny. I release you, sisters. I release you, sisters. I release you. Brothers, I release you in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Now, please, is this all the prayer requests? In one minute, we are going to pray. And then there are three areas, three more areas I need to speak. Finance, breakthrough, this is very important. Please keep your spirit open. If possible, just be praying in tongues. Let me invite the ministers. Pastor Williams, please come. Bishop, come. We are going to pray. Pastor Williams is going to lead us. Hallelujah. Let me tell you something. As the servant of God is speaking on this thing and as we are agreeing, I want you to be, this is not a ritual. Don't take it as a ritual. The scriptural revelation behind this for those of you who are just coming the Bible says how that listen, listen, listen Hezekiah took the threat letter are you listening to me? A threat letter was written and the Bible says he took it to the altar and dropped it before God. When Hannah needed a miracle, the Bible says she came to the altar. Are you hearing me? This is the revelation behind this. We don't do anything without revelation. So I want you to connect. Everybody rise up and stretch your hands. Just stretch your hands towards this stage, please. Those outside, just stretch it towards your screen. And begin to pray in tongues. Zetalabra kata satalibe, lika lumis ibra kata satalaba. 
Sebrati Kodosh in a Satala Bakadashi, Ekaka Satala Bratish, Sebrina Kalazum in a Katashia, Rabatasha do the Bratti Kalabush Tava, Kesibro de Kataka Bakatasha, Rubinani Sumina Kayana Daba Satala Bra, Ekasu Abinis Ekalabitoshitaba, Rubinana Zebra Kapata Shitalaba. Yes, I need one of us to practice. In the name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, oh Jehovah, Father of all spirits, the great I am, may the subic release in Amakata Sata, Lisa Pata Shekabara. The one that divided the Red Sea, Lika Zipra The one that released manna, Paul released manna from heaven, Jehovah. In the name of your son, Jesus Christ, I pray for miracles, miracles, miracles upon this prayer request. Miracles, visitations, miracles, visitation. Far above, far above all they have written. Far above, far above connection, completion, perfections in the name of Jesus. Completions, perfections in the name of Jesus. Miracles, miracles, visitation, divine visitation. Jehovah, Jehovah, miracle worker upon this request. Breathe upon it. Breathe upon it. Breathe upon it. Let them be miracles. Let your people testify in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Bless your name, Jehovah. In Jesus' name we pray. It is done in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We are a prosperous ministry. Are you hearing what I'm saying? We are a prosperous ministry. Mysteriously prosperous. By the hand of God. I believe in prosperity. Are you hearing what I'm saying? I believe you cannot truly represent the government of heaven with poverty. You cannot help the poor by being one of them. Are you hearing me? And I want to pray for you. Please believe. Lift your hands. See, listen. The irrefutable laws of prosperity remains tithing, kingdom investments, and your givings. They open the heaven and position you. And then the blessings begin to come through divine ideas, favor, wisdom the blessings of god upon your hands strength and long life hallelujah i want to encourage everybody please bring out a seed i can't pray for you for prosperity just like that please please this if you don't have a revelation of what we are doing just keep your seat please this is not so i won't help you let me tell you the truth i'm not going to help you it's not just about saying receive no Please, God has blessed you. You can help somebody by your side. Please, please. Bring out something that will cost you. Some of you are greedy and stingy. See, let me tell you something. I pray for you that giving grace will be part of your life. Many of you think God is out to rob. You can't outgive God. Hallelujah. The secret of prosperity is giving. It will never change. There are many of you, God has been speaking to you. You won't listen. I can't tell you how many times God has instructed me to empty my accounts. If you see, if your heart is still on prosperity, God will never give you. He said, my son, give me your heart. Until you conquer greed, you are not entitled to handle true riches. Are you hearing what I'm saying? Please bring out a seed. Some of you will bring out something that will cost you. Let me tell you, don't pity yourself. Don't pity yourself at all. Don't make foolish, impulsive decisions. Are you hearing me? We are not manipulating people. 
Don't make stupid decisions that you come outside. And, no, no. Make some of you, God is speaking to you right now. Some of you need to stand for your families. Honestly, honestly. See, if the ministry is blessed and you are not blessed, it means we are fake. Something is wrong. Are you hearing me? I tell you, this, this prosperity oil, there is an oil. It will come upon some of you in a fearful way. Please, inside and outside, I beg you, if you don't have a seed, can you hold the hands of somebody who has a seed? Please, connect. Allow the person to hold your hands. Don't feel bad. Please stand up, everybody. This is a very serious thing. Lift your hands and lift your seed. Hear me? Solomon, there was a sacrifice upon the altar. And Solomon said, oh God, oh God, attend unto your people whenever they call you that you will respond. And the Bible says the glory, the Shekinah of God came and filled that me. I'm praying, I'm praying. See, I tell you, it, it, it pains my heart. It pains, we want to, the full gospel, you must represent the kingdom in its entirety. We don't just want you to be anointed and be begging and be sleeping with men for money. No. Are you hearing what I'm saying? Please lift. Some of you, what will come upon you is the giving grace. Because honestly, for some of you, is greed. Greed. Even to yourself. Lift it up. I want to pray. Oh, God has given us this anointing. And I want to pray. My God, it will happen. It's going to come on like fire. It will fall on many of you. Please help me. My God, I pray. The oil of prosperity. The power to get wealth. At the count of three. My God, let it fall mightily. Right now. One, two, three. Take it. Take it. Take it, take it, take it, shake it, take it, take it, take it. I activate it outside. I activate it. Let fire come upon your seed. I give your seed a voice in the spirit. It took a sacrifice to put your family in poverty. We use this sacrifice. To bring them out of poverty it took a sacrifice to enter a covenant of poverty we take this seed and bring you into the realm of blessing psalm 66 verse 12 it said thou hast caused men to ride upon our heads we walk through waters and through fire but thou broughtest us into a wealthy place my god you know we are not fake we are not just trying to do religious jamboree to take money from people i pray my god i give your seed a voice and i instruct it go around the earth gather your kind and return back to the owner I prophesy under this apostolic unction. I speak to your seed. Go around the earth. Gather your kind. Go around the earth. Gather your kind. Go around the earth. Gather your kind. And return a hundredfold. Hallelujah. Please cast your seeds with joy quickly. Help me. Please bring the offering basket. Hallelujah. Now I want to pray. Finally, before the altar call, breakthroughs. There are families that need major breakthroughs. Are you hearing me? There are some of you, your, the way from the day they gave birth to you, you have never celebrated entering a house that God gave your own family. Embarrassment after embarrassment. Every time they start a building project, rain will wash it, or something satanic will happen breakthrough is when the limitations that are stopping you are taken away lift your hands uh, 
the Bible says, Thou shalt break forth on the right and on the left. Thou shalt break forth. Please receive it. Some of you need to call your loved ones and say, Look, a prayer was prayed. There are some houses that have been built. Ten years. Ten years is a cost. It's a cost. I'm telling you. There are some people. They are, they are lecturers. But they are still begging for money to feed. This is, this is the yoke of bondage. There are families that live from hand to mouth. Some of you, as you are looking at me now, you are the ones who are the breadwinners of your entire family. As young as you are, it ought not to be so. The Bible says, a good man liveth an inheritance not taken from his children's children. Lift your hands, please. Where is the God that brings breakthrough? Where is that God that changed the story of Samaria by the mouth of the prophet? Where is that God that instructed the prophet to say by this time, my God and my King, I pray for Koinonia in the name of Jesus. Let this breaker anointing like the angel of death in the days of Moses, let this breakthrough anointing begin to go from house to house. House to house, house to house, we send it to Abuja, we send it to Saria, we send it to Kogi State, we send it to Lagos, we send it to Kaduna. Like the angel of death visited his homes. This night, this night, this night, I speak, this night, let this anointing go to families and create the Garden of Eden. Let it create the garden of Eden. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. How many of you have noticed the sudden death of professors? How many of you have noticed it? Have you seen the way lecturers are dying like chickens? How many of you know it's not normal? See, the Bible says they know not. You do not know what is happening this night this night the angel of the lord will move across abu are you hearing me altars of darkness will be dethroned see this is why god put centers like this to legislate on behalf of territories the apostolic grace is not for making mouth it's for taking charge it's a rule thou in the midst of your enemies the church is the light of the world the church cannot be here and things are happening if your father is a lecturer or you live with a lecturer i want you to lift your hands we want to prophesy that oil of exemption hallelujah it's terrible people are afraid right now because nobody knows who is next i pray for you see when the angel of death hear me when the angel of death came to Goshen and Egypt, the angel of death killed everybody. It's just that when he came, he found out that some houses were already killed. When he saw blood on their house, he said, these people are already died. And he passed by. I pray, that blood of sprinkling, that blood, he said, when I see the blood, Rabato Koparatata, not by accident, not by terrorism, in the name of the Lord Jesus, I command supernatural preservation. Receive it now. Supernatural preservation. Receive it now. Every lecturer in APU and in all the institutions in this town, because I already see the arrows of death on some lecturers the lord is ministering to me and i'm seeing that between now and december 4 i see four other professors going but we stop it we change it in the name of jesus we stop it we change it we stop it we change it we stop it he said the heaven of heavens 
Roberto Podoko Talabatika. The heaven of heavens belongs to the Lord. But the earth has he given. Now let me pray for you. You, 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 you have no covenant with death. We are entering the ember months now. Hallelujah. Please, see, take seriously the things that happen here. Are you hearing me? Liver is the power of God that is bringing her up stage. It's a sign and a wonder. Just cover her. Hallelujah. Please, we're out of time. I want to pray for you. Lift your hands. See, listen. Hear me, those inside and outside. Never believe. Hear me, please. Now, and I don't want you to feel bad. I know that there are a lot of people here that have had to lose loved ones. We've stood by you, but don't let the death of your loved one suddenly make you give room for Satan and say he can ride into your family anytime. Are you hearing what I'm saying? Every time death is ravaging people, God will summon the people and anoint men to lift up a cry. I want to pray for you. Ember month is the time when people, look at how many people just graduate from ABU. Going back, they die. Don't tell me that's the will of God. Some of you, as they are giving your parents work, that's it. If there is a shrine, there is a greater shrine. See, this is the speaking of altars. Every altar speak. The Bible tells us that the blood of Jesus speaketh better things. I want to speak on behalf of people. Lift your hands, please. Because many of us travel. There are some of us who are in business. You travel to Lagos. You travel to Kotono. Some of you are moving around. Some of you are coming from different places. My Duguri, Joss, Bauchi. Come out of her now. Out. Out of her. Now. A very violent spirit. Lift your hands. Say after me, Father, in the name of Jesus, I declare that I am protected from the arrows that fly by day and the noisome pestilence. I declare that throughout this year, I have no covenant with the spirit of death. Say, death, hear my voice i am an ambassador and in the name of jesus the seal of the blood is upon me i am protected my family members are protected father in the name of jesus i believe your word and i declare that i enjoy supernatural preservation in my going out and in my coming in say in my going out and in my coming in therefore i pray for you that as you have declared let your eyes live to see the experience in the name of jesus christ hallelujah hallelujah you've not given your heart to jesus please remain standing everyone here please remain standing hallelujah you have not given your heart to the Lord Jesus Christ this is a family this is where we are ready to introduce you to the love of your life the Bible says whoever will come to him he will in no wise cast away many of us have been struggling you've been struggling some of you are born again you've given your heart to the Lord truly but there are encumbrances pushing you away from God. Right now, please everybody stand. I know you've been standing. Please stand for one last time. Inside and outside, let's honor God. And let's honor the greatest miracle that is about to happen. Young and old, rich or poor, as you hear my voice, the Holy Ghost is going to be talking to some of you. 
and he's going to tell you it is time the bible says in the day that you hear his voice harden not your heart you've never given your heart to the lord or you have found yourself derailing i don't care what you have done there is a home for you tonight as everybody begins to appreciate them i want you to leave your seat and come out right now everybody come out from outside god bless you outside sister brother don't sit back people are coming thank you jesus thank you jesus don't sit back don't wait for somebody to come please keep clapping koinonia no devil will stop you god bless you sir god bless you they are coming please appreciate them don't sit back there are a lot of you outside god is speaking to you brothers god is speaking to a lot of brothers outside don't let your friends stop you don't let your friends stop you keep coming keep coming thank god for the harvest keep coming dearly beloved i hope you were blessed by this message do not keep the video to yourself share to as many as you can to help them bless check our home page for more of our messages subscribe to the channel comment on it like it see you on our next video bye pray 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 for your destiny the phase of development lord grant me the discipline